All right, so we got a first look at Mr. Joker, played by Jared Leto. I'm on the fence. I like it, but then I don't like it. I get they're going for the modern touch, but I feel it's too modern to almost where it kind of stares away from the character and the source material. It's good to, you know, develop and branch away from the source material every now and then, but I feel like they kind of went a little too far, like that all the tattoos and the tattoos on the face, like it distracts me. Like, it's a Joker, but I'm not seeing the Joker, you know? It's really distracting, like the tattoos on the body, cool, at least those can be hid with like a uniform or suit or whatever. But on the face, I'm like, oh, you kind of just took me out of that element and that character already who all of his emotions, all of his rage, all of his psychoticness, all of his your comedic everything comes from the face and the expression and his makeup or whichever way they want to go to the war paint or that's his actual skin. Doing that and just throwing tattoos all over it kind of distracts. And when I see him, I won't see I won't see madness. I won't see psycho. I'll just see a thug. And I don't I see Hot Topic. He looks like a guy who on five different Hot Topic interviews and got rejected from all of them. So he's like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm just going to do my own damn thing and I'm just going to be emo. There you go. And dye my hair green. Like, I don't... Again, I'd have to see it in motion. I'd have to see a trailer. I'd have to see it in action. But for right now, based on this image, it's cool for... A bad guy and something else. Like, if you made another movie and he's a bad guy and that's his look, cool. If you're doing this for the Joker, ah, oh, you lost me. You lost me. It's cool, but you lost me. A little bit. I feel like it's too modern, too out there. I'd have to see a performance and how he puts it all together. But right now, from image, I can only go off that. And right now, I'm not. I'm, I'm split. I'm split right down the middle. I went cross-eyed. I see it. Right down the middle. That's where I'm at. I'm not completely against it. I'm not like, oh my god, I hate this. No, it's... I'm indecisive. I'm indecisive. Um, but it's cool. I guess it looks cool. Um, definitely going for the killing joke inspiration there with the, you know, the pose of the picture and everything like that. But I don't know, guys. Well, he has a hard thing to do topping Heath Ledger anyway in the first place, but this shift is interesting. It's definitely interesting. I'm curious to see where they go. Like I said, I have to see it in action. What do you guys think? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Are you like me? Are you in the fence? You don't know? You're not sure which way to go about it? Because I don't know which way to go about it. I'm being frankly honest. I want to see pictures of the rest of the team. I want to see Will Smith. And I want to see Margot Robbie. Those are the two I'm worried about. And Tom Hardy, but he's not in anymore, so I don't care about it. I don't care about Red Flag anymore. Don't care. Because Joel Kinnaman, ugh. Jai Courtney, ugh. Got model chick, whatever. But we'll see, Crime Fighters, where it goes. Let me know your thoughts on it. I'm curious. Well, like I said, we'll see. Till more to come, till we get visuals of movement and talking, I can only go off a picture, and it's not that bad, I guess. But, anywho, you know the deal. Join me on the road to 1,000 subscribers, like, comment, and share. Subscribe, if you haven't already. And let me know what you think of this crazy, crazy picture. <laughs> that was my Jared Level Joker. Did you get that? It was horrible, I, I know.